it's 9.32 in the morning and Leah and I are currently somewhere in Nevada and we are on Interstate 80. Prime, we've been driving for about maybe like 13 hours at this point. So if you're curious why we are in the car approximately a thousand miles or so away from home, Leah, what are we gonna go do? We're getting a puppy. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So we are getting another dog to add to our family. <laughs> and when we got Sierra, our current dog, uh, we got her from a breeder in Roseville, California. And about two weeks ago, we were looking at Instagram and our breeder posted that she had availability for two puppies. And I don't know if it was wine fueled or what at that period of time, but I said, well, how much does she want? And we messaged her. Long story short, now we're getting a puppy. Yeah, we've been thinking about it for a while. We always kind of talk about like, oh, maybe we should get another dog um, to have a puppy and another dog for Sierra to just kind of play with and be entertained with. So we've been thinking about it, but it was just kind of like, when's the right time? And so we kind of felt like, all right, maybe this is like a good time in some ways um, before we really get deep into construction on the house. We have maybe a couple months where we can spend a little more time with the dog training and um, yeah working with potty training and they're gonna need a little more attention of course in the beginning so we just thought oh what the heck so we're on our way yep and of course this is gonna be another golden retriever and especially because we're up in the mountains and we've got you know a good couple acres of property between you know the two homes we actually have kind of the space now to take on another dog whereas when we were in the city, like that probably would have been a, an absolute nightmare. So anyway, we'll check in with you guys as we get closer. Well, we're about in California and you know how you can tell that you're about to come into California? They basically have like border control when you come across and we're going to stop here in a split second, and the entire reason for that is so that they can ask us questions about what shit we're potentially bringing into their state. Oh. <laughs> well, or there's nobody there. There's nobody here. Shocker. So California government not doing their thing, I guess. Pretty soon we arrived at our breeder's house, excited to meet our new fur baby. At this point, she had two puppies left for us to choose from, so we tried to decide which one would be a good fit for us. Now this breeder is really good at getting to know the puppy's personality in conjunction with all the families that are going to be taking the puppies home, and so she helps us kind of decide which one would be a good fit for us, as well as Sierra, since she knows her personality as well. What was the reasons for picking him? Yeah, what are you thinking? Um, I think he is, um, I, I think he's going to balance her out. Okay. He's going to bring out her puppy side, uh -huh. but he's not overly, because we have some that are overly um, excitable. Yeah. He's somewhere in between. Okay. And I just, there's something about him. I, yeah. So I sat here for a long time and I looked at him and I said, I really just like <laughs> this puppy. I just yeah. like everything yeah. about him. Aww. I, I love his head, <laughs> I love his structure, I love the way he looks, and then of course yeah. I love his temperament because he's very snuggly. Oh, uh, that'll go well that. with our yes. group, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to switch? I'll give that. <laughs> he's got little white eyebrows. Oh. Is it on? Yep, yeah. it's on, yep. <laughs> so look at that. Hey, you? Have you been asleep? You? They know they They've been handled. Super cool. <laughs> well, actually, he's been asleep with mom. He's been back there all morning. Oh, hello. Oh, look at He's all snuggled up, too. What do you think? We ready for a nice ride back in the car? Oh. I know, probably not. Turn him over, Lewis, on his back. I want to huh? see. Uh, turn him over on his back. I want to see how he responds to you. 
You might take a second to settle. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Let's see what. It went dark. Oh, it's okay. I mean, it's, it's actually still, still on with oh, the preview it. screen. But if you tap it, it'll, yeah. Should we put you down on the ground? Let's see. Yeah, maybe sit with him rather than stand because yeah. the height does. Um... Hey, pup. <laughs> Hello. I mean, Black is sweet too, but he's much more rambunctious. Did I wake you up? I know he's sleeping. It's <laughs> kind of hard to say. What are you smelling? <laughs> what are you smelling? Once we chose our pup, we got the car all set up, and then it was time to head right back to Colorado. Okay, and we're off. All right, so look, this is Denali. Everybody say hi. So we just picked this little guy up. Like I said, his name is Denali. And we just left the breeder and we're gonna be heading back. No real reason to stick around anywhere. We wanna get him home and get him used to our house and everything. So we're just heading straight back. So we got another long drive ahead of us. We've got the back set up here with everything. And, and he's feeling a little antsy, but I'm sure he'll go to sleep soon. How was it, Lewis? Oh, it's good. I mean, I'm glad that we got the the right one, and I think he's a good, good, cute little pup. So hopefully, it's a nice, easy drive back. Oh yeah, with Sierra, we only had about a two hour-ish drive, and um, so that was pretty easy. She was asleep the whole time, so hopefully, maybe we'll get a couple hour stints um, where he falls asleep, and then we'll kind of stop. We've got a kind of a litter box set up here if we need that. Um, so I think we've got just about everything we need. Hi. Hi, baby. It's here. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah, you're a good boy. Go get her. Hi. Hi, sweetie. It's 8.13 a.m. on Saturday, and we are back in the state of Colorado. Been over the border for about an hour or so after the quickest drive to California and back. Leah's back there with the pup. Yep. Who... Is sleeping again. Is asleep again. <laughs> How's the pup been, Leah? Oh, he's been good. He's slept most of the way, but he's definitely getting a little restless here towards the end. Um, getting a little more daring and bold and <coughs> kind of wanting to do stuff. I think he probably wants to get out of the car. So. I think we both do. Just struggling with lack of sleep. Got some Starbucks. But almost there. <laughs> yeah, definitely think a nice nap when we get back is going to be absolutely necessary. That in a shower. Yeah, I know you won't. 
my hair. Hey, Sierra. So I'm just here with this little guy. It is Tuesday and we are just getting in the groove of potty training and our routine and everything. He's been doing pretty good. Um, we've had just a couple accidents, but again, that's always just our fault for not taking him out quick enough, um, but he's doing super good. He's sleeping through the night. Um, which is good because I kind of got a little sick after we <laughs> drove for like two days straight and I didn't get much sleep. So um, I am just working on taking him out for his afternoon potty break. We'll see if he can go and you guys will see how he's doing. Come on. Look at that. He learned how to do stairs up and down literally the first day we were home. Come on, buddy. Sometimes I carry him down, but he's really good at going up for sure. See, it might be too quick. I took him out like an hour ago or so. Actually, no, sorry. He had an accident an hour ago. So it's might be too quick, but if we're having accidents, we're probably not taking him out often enough. So we're just trying to stay on top of it. What's up, buddy? Hi. He's been loving exploring the snow with Sierra. Where are you going? Come on. <laughs> Try one more time and we'll go back in. Okay, ready? Go ahead. Hey, where are you going? Sinali, let's go inside. Come on. Sinali. Good boy. Good job. Good job, buddy. Let's go. Let's go inside. See Sierra. There's Sierra, chilling out. He's been wearing her out. Haven't you been? Yeah. 